Today we're gonna to get into some fitness marketing ideas for gym owners and personal trainers. Now that at-home workouts and training is all the rage in the wellness industry, now's the perfect time for your trainers like you and your employees to show their muscle. Spread fitness through these fitness marketing ideas. There's no denying that demand for the healthier lifestyle is yet to dwindle. As a matter of fact, despite harrowing recent events, the growth continues consistently, but with a few exceptions. But how do you cope in this increasingly competitive and changing market, especially with the new year coming around? T -O hey guys, welcome to Creative. Here we use our passion for the game to change the game. Every week we talk about solutions that can truly change the business of sports. Today we'll be discussing some fitness marketing ideas for all of you gym owners out there and personal trainers. Revolutionize the game and don't forget to lift that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out on anything in the future. It's understandable for personal trainers and gym owners to feel uncertainty during these hard times. But despite the harrowing year that was of 2020, the wellness and fitness industry is remaining strong and fit. Studies have revealed that since last year, downloads on health and fitness apps increased by 46% worldwide. With more on their hands at home, sales for home workout equipment have increased from January to March 2020 in the US. Ultimately, the demand for healthier lifestyles is still growing, except this time, people want to do it within the comforts of their own homes. So, with these changes, how can personal trainers and or gym owners adapt and hopefully thrive? So first off, you have to realize that working out at home is somewhat of a new norm. These significant changes pose newer threats. With lesser gyms open, trainers and gym owners are faced with the new reality of utilizing digital platforms they might not be used to. But on the other side of things, the rise of that in-home workout presents trainers with new opportunities of exercising flexibility. Here's how you can use this major change to your advantage through the fitness marketing ideas I'm about to give. First and foremost, on our list is of course social media marketing. Instagram is one of the major drives of growth within the wellness industry, especially since fitness Instagram became such a big thing. Now, chances are you already have an existing personal account or business account on the platform, but you obviously can't use that one for your brand. So create a new professional account. Thanks to recent updates from Instagram, users can now create creators or business accounts made specifically for companies and other public figures. When you have a creator's account, you can see insights to your content's performance. You can see whether your followers are engaging with your content and how far has your posts reached. It allows you to have more space for important details like your contact number and gives you more call to action buttons to use whenever you post something. Despite the abundance of fitness apps and workouts, YouTube accounts on the internet, Instagram remains to be the leading channel for the wellness industry. So to make sure that you're not missing out on anything important, go ahead and create that creator's account right now. No, I mean it. Stop the video and go create that account. The second fitness marketing idea you can definitely leverage today is a personal fitness journey. Gym goers like myself have said it before. Working out is much of a mental challenge as it is physically. As a beginner, building the habit of working out every day can be hard, especially when you're doing it alone at your home or you have a little two-year-old running around jumping all over you. So to make things less lonely and scary for your audiences, share your personal fitness journal with them. Put it online, show some of your routines. 
Create content around the hardships you faced when you were starting out and provide them with actionable solutions that they could do during their first few workouts. Another great approach at debunking the fear around working out is by dedicating a series of short video clips or blogs to debunking common misconceptions around training and stacking that content on different platforms depending on your audiences. By humanizing your image as a friend of your audience that keeps them accountable for their progress, your target market gets the feeling that your relationship with them is intimate and personal. Emotional connection is one of the greatest secret ingredients to personal brands. If you look at some of the most efficient marketing campaigns around fitness, you'll see the trend of sharing motivational and moving stories. If you want to build a strong relationship with your audiences, you need to be able to truly connect with them and relate to them. Like we've mentioned earlier, there's a rising trend of home workouts across global thanks to recent events. This left trainers wondering how are they going to hold classes within their own homes. Thankfully, technology answered this form from YouTube videos, live streaming, Zoom meetings. Let's say you have a couple of existing clients that you haven't seen for a while. Why not reach out to them and offer virtual classes or sessions? Thanks to social media channels like Facebook and Instagram, you can easily live stream workout sessions through your phone. Invite people to join in and there you have your first virtual class. What's great about doing sessions similar to these is it showcases the flexibility of your personal brand. People can see that you're more than willing to meet your clients halfway and provide them with guided wellness classes, which have become very detrimental to a lot of us these days. You can also create YouTube videos around apartment friendly workout routines and other exercises that don't require complicated setups or equipment. Learning how to create your content and to use these social media channels to your advantage may take some time, but it's a great investment in the long run. You can offer virtual guidance to your clients as well as consultations within the comfort of their home and convenience is always a plus to consumers. Another great thing that you can do is share fitness freebies with your target audience. Because most people are starting their fitness journey on their own, search engines like Google is their ultimate companion. They use it to look up at-home workouts, healthy meal recipes, and other articles around fitness. So instead of outrightly selling your experience and knowledge, why not give out free samples through downloadable eBooks on wellness? Similar to YouTube video idea, you can leverage your website and existing clients list to offer free trials of your services. You can provide them with free workout guides and other eBooks like healthy meal recipes to showcase your capability and style as a fitness instructor. You can build a brand new email list by offering weekly tips, nutritional advice, and other informative think pieces that you feel could be of use to your clients. When you have freebies available online, chances are your current clients will share this information with other people they know. And though some things have changed in the marketing game, nothing really beats the technique of word of mouth. Encourage your clients to share referral codes so that their friends can try out your services. The last, if not the most important fitness marketing idea a personal trainer like you can adopt is personal branding. Ever wondered how politicians, athletes, celebrities are able to promote themselves without any issue? It's all thanks to their personal branding. Defined as the practice of promoting oneself and their career as a brand, it's the continuous process of developing and maintaining your reputation to the public as a professional. It's a pretty nifty trick that can help you stand out amongst a sea of other personal trainers in your locality. But to be fair, personal branding is an investment. It takes a long time and if you do it yourself, it's the whole time equals money, not money equals time. 
you can easily get lost in the maze of things to remember, but there are two things you need to keep in mind to be consistent as a personal brand. First, stay focused. A mistake commonly made by most people starting out is losing sight of themselves. Instead of trying to be everything for everyone, choose a key message that you truly believe in and that resonates with your people and stick with it. Having one fundamental value makes consistency much easier. Whenever you plan out content to share on your social media accounts or your website, make sure that it aligns with your values. Lastly, you need to stay genuine. People are more cynical these days. They can easily see through unthoughtful acts. Keep in mind that personal trainers' success is built around their clientele in the community or focused fan base they have built among themselves. So stay true to yourself and your intentions as a trainer. Health and wellness is a pretty personal topic for most people. That's why it's important that you build trustworthy and genuine relationships with your audiences. There's a lot of uncertainty surrounding 2020 especially for the health and wellness industry that's dealing with several changes within its playing field. But now that we're into 2021, that's how most people separate successful personal trainers from those who aren't. Despite the seemingly unending disadvantages, the new normal presents personal trainers with several other opportunities to expand their business. If they try to actually find and learn from them, that is. If you wanna learn more about the different ways you can leverage those new opportunities, make sure to check out the rest of our videos on digital marketing. We hope you guys loved today's video. And if you wanna learn more about the great solutions that can truly change the game, don't forget to lift that subscribe button and that notification bell. Now this is Zach with Creative, where business is our sport. <laughs>